hey guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl tally and i'm back with another video so today as you can see down by the title i will be giving you two quick and easy affordable remedies for each rash whether it's for a baby or it's for an adult now this video is not sponsored i'm just here to assist my mothers and fathers into getting this this eat rash under control so guys thank you so so much for the continuous love and support i really do appreciate it and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe turn on your post notification bell so you could be notified whenever i post let's get into it look at someone and wonder what is going on inside their head now these types of rash are very armless but they are very very itchy to the skin now sometimes they are referred to as eat rash in some places they are referred to as prickle rash sweat rash or malaria now these types of rash causes small red spots in places where sweat collects such as your armpits your back under the breast chest groin elbow creases and back of the knees and sometimes too you might find it on your waistline most painful thing about these rashes is that they can itch you to the point where you cut your own skin especially for babies they are not aware of how to maneuver the situation how to handle the situation now the best way in which we can assist or help or the toddlers or the infants and to release thin these kinds of pressure how we relieve them from this kind of itching or re relieve them from these kind of bruises we take care of them and i want to give you all the remedies in which i use to take care of my daughter's eat rash oh i ease her pain oh i ease the old point you know when they itch it especially if their nails are sharp you have to keep their nails short as well because they cannot handle the situation and they don't know how to get rid of this feeling we have to assist them all right so some of the ways in which you can help to prevent eat rash or rashes on your skin well, all right so let's start with the babies for babies especially now that it's summertime dress the kids light these are some of the things that you can use when you're dressing your babies dress them light for me personally the climate in my country is very hot it's very hot right now so when it comes on to summer i always dress my daughter in chemise when it comes on to her bottom half of her night gowns especially in the night time i dress her very light so it's either i put on a short pajama shorts and alongside a chemise and this is what i refer to as chemise as you know oil when you use too much oil on your skin it produces heat and sweat now for my daughter personally i don't use any of our oils on her skin the only place i put oil is on her pubic area and her bottom because she's a baby and of course she's still wearing diaper at night times so i still have to moisturize her pubic area but when it comes down to her arms her leg her tummy or back no there's a particular cream or ointment that i use on her skin that doesn't produce oil and produce sweat and i'm going to show you that cream in a few and also too i use powder mild powder so that it doesn't affect our sinus either so these are some of the things that you can do to keep your baby cool and from being irritated all right so we spoke about what is eat rash what causes eat rash and how to prevent eat rash now these are remedies that i have been using on especially my daughter the moment she was here my daughter was born in the summer so we know how that goes she was born when the heat is on and when i took her to the six day clinic the doctor slash nurse referred this powder to me and to be honest i used it for like three days and the rashes were gone and this is the powder that i used so the lander baby powder is very 
very very effective when it comes on to eat rash now at the time when my daughter had the eat rash and the nurse referred lander baby powder to me it was on her forehead now can you put powder on forehead of course powder can go anywhere except you know yeah except in your private it's an external use not an internal use now the pimples slash rashes were on my daughter's forehead and the nurse told me that i can use lander baby powder i use very small amounts because you don't want it to go in her eye you just want to put it on the affected area which was on her forehead and let me tell you within three days the rashes were gone and this ain't no cap they disappeared and when i went back to the clinic i had to tell the nurse thank you now another remedy that i used and this was referred to me by a pharmacist and this let me tell you this works wonders for me when it comes on to insect bite bites whether it's mosquito bites or she receive a scrape or a cut whether she fall or so forth i put this ointment on it it helps with disappearing of scars dark spots uh it helps with rashes and it also helps with cuts and bruises this is beautiful <laughs> You might be wondering what is this magic cream that sally is talking about well the magic cream that i am talking about is right here it's called the hydrocortisone cream this is the cream right here that i am making reference to the hydrocortisone cream now i'm going to give you some of the benefits of using this cream and what this cream can be used for now this cream is for a temporary relief of itching associated with minor skin irritations inflammation and rashes due to eczema soaps cirrhosis detergents seboric dermitis cosmetic jewelry and so much more like insect bites so this cream was recommended to me by my family pharmacist now as i mentioned before this cream works wonders for my daughter this ointment if my daughter is having any form of itching i remember like three days ago or probably five days ago my daughter had some rushes in the inner creases of her arm and let me tell you i bathed her and i put the cream on it and by the next day it disappeared you know sometimes also too you need to catch the problem from its young as you see the problem attack it if she received like an insect bite and I put it on it, the mark disappeared. So this cream does wonders. It works wonders. It's worth it. And it's not even a lot of money for it. It's very affordable. It's very affordable. In Jamaica, it's 700 Jamaican dollars. Very affordable. So guys, we have come to the end of the video. I do hope that you guys learned something from this video. I do hope that I shed some light on how you can help with rashes. And also too, if you felt comfortable or if it is that you have used this product again, you can feel free to comment down below. Let's have some chit chat in the comment section. And guys, thank you so, so much for watching this video. If you have made it to the end of the video, thank you so, so much. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, bye.